Iraq's ancient history and relics from the world's oldest civilizations on display at the Iraq Museum in central Baghdad. The walls and corridors of this gallery are adorned with stone carvings dating back to the time of the Assyrians and Babylonians, societies that predate Jesus Christ by thousands of years. Luma al duri has worked at the Iraq Museum since 1999. She says in the weeks leading up to the 2003 U.S.-led invasion, she and her colleagues warned Iraqi and American officials that the museum was vulnerable, but no one seemed to listen. More than 15,000 pieces were stolen just from this museum. And um, um, they damaged everything, the uh, furniture and um, um, everything. Almost immediately, officials began efforts to get back the relics. Along with U.S. support, a recovery department was set up. Objects were unearthed from private homes, recovered in raids, and some simply reappeared on the museum's shelves. Other treasures were seized from international antiquities markets in Jordan, Lebanon, Syria, Kuwait, Saudi Arabia, and as far away as New York including this piece known as the Basekti statue. The 150-kilogram bronze relic dates back to the ancient Mesopotamian Akkadian period and is one of the few recovered objects that have now been put back on display. Some of the Iraq Museum's finest antiquities aren't on display at all. They're bricked up in storage rooms far from public view. So off-limits are the vaults and their contents such a safely guarded secret we weren't allowed anywhere near them. That's because of concerns over Iraq's readiness to preserve and protect its own treasures. The rapid rise of ISIL and years of violent sectarian divisions have all raised questions about the museum's safety. It's my history and I should be proud to put these pieces in this gallery, but it's, um, it's not allowed now. It's not just artifacts stored at the museum that are at risk. Iraq has 12,000 known archaeological sites where Sumerian, Akkadian, Babylonian, Persian and ancient Islamic sites once stood. Many are not protected and have been looted for years. So while some of Iraq's artifacts remain on display or hidden away, much of its ancient heritage continues to be threatened. Imtiaz Taib, Al Jazeera at the Iraq Museum in Baghdad.